Hey there, adventurers. Are you ready for an exciting journey into the animal kingdom? We're going on a wild adventure to learn about amazing creatures and how they survive. From the highest mountains to the deepest oceans, animals have incredible ways of living. Let's explore together. Get ready to meet furry friends, feathered friends, swimming friends, and even some buzzing friends. We'll learn about their special features and how they use them every day. Remember, every animal is important and plays a role in our amazing world. So put on your explorer hats, grab your binoculars, and let's discover the wonders of the animal kingdom together. Our adventure begins now. Our first stop is the mammal habitat. Mammals are warm-blooded animals. This means they can keep their bodies warm even when it's cold outside. Most mammals have fur or hair to keep them cozy. They also give birth to live babies and feed them milk. Look at the mother bear and her cubs. See her thick fur? It keeps her warm during the winter. Mammals have sharp teeth for eating. Some mammals, like deer, have special teeth for grinding plants. Others, like lions, have sharp teeth for tearing meat. Mammals are found all over the world. They live in forests, deserts, oceans, and even in your own backyard. Remember to always observe mammals from a safe distance and never try to touch them without an adult. Next, we're taking flight to visit our feathered friends, the birds. Birds are amazing because they can fly. Their wings and lightweight bones help them soar through the air. Birds have beaks instead of mouths. Look at this hummingbird. Its long beak helps it drink nectar from flowers. Some birds have strong beaks for cracking seeds, while others have sharp beaks for catching fish. Birds build nests to lay their eggs and raise their young. Nests can be made of twigs, grass, mud, and even spider webs. Birds are important pollinators, meaning they help plants make more flowers. They also eat insects, which helps keep the ecosystem in balance. Section 4. Swimming friends. Fish. Get ready to dive into the water as we explore the world of fish. Fish live underwater and breathe through their gills. Gills are special organs that help fish take in oxygen from the water. Look at this colourful clownfish. Its scales are smooth and help it move easily through the water. Fish have fins that help them swim. Some fish have big, powerful fins for swimming fast, while others have fins that help them camouflage or even walk on the ocean floor. Fish come in all shapes, sizes and colours. Some fish are tiny, while others, like the whale shark, can grow to be bigger than a bus. Section 5 Buzzing Friends Insects our last stop takes us to the fascinating world of insects. Insects are the smallest animals we'll be learning about today. Insects have six legs and a hard exoskeleton, which is like a suit of armour that protects their bodies. Look at this ladybug. It has tiny black spots on its red shell. Insects have antennae that they use to smell, touch and even hear. They also have mouths that are specially designed for eating different types of food. Some insects, like butterflies, drink nectar from flowers. Others, like ants, work together in colonies to gather food and build their homes. Insects play a vital role in our ecosystem by pollinating plants, decomposing organic matter and providing food for other animals. Section 6 animals need our help. Wow, we've learned so much about amazing animals today. We've explored the world of mammals, birds, fish and insects and discovered how they survive in their different habitats. Remember, it's important to treat all animals with kindness and respect. We share this planet with them and we need to do our part to protect them and their homes. You can help by learning more about animals, appreciating them in their natural habitats and supporting organisations that work to conserve wildlife. Keep exploring, keep asking questions and never stop being amazed by the wonders of the animal kingdom.